so this is the current situation in my kitchen right now just look guys i don't have a working space in this kitchen it's actually a mess it's terrible so this house was primarily it wasn't like a rental house and so later on the landlord had to like subdivide it into, into sections so that he can let it out and for some reason my plan is to create something with a countertop and storage space and place it at this area of focus that is next to the cooker so that i'll be able to use it to prepare my gradients while cooking and store other things that i don't have anywhere to store in this kitchen As you can see, our main material for this project is this MDF board that we got from a local store at our shop. The other material that we're using is these ceramic tiles. It's the big one, the big squared ones that has a that have a glossy finish and they are the ones that we place at the top to create our counter. As you can see behind me, there is some changes that are in my kitchen and also as as you've been able you can be able to tell from the title i've done some a mini kitchen makeover for 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 a rental friendly it's one that is rental friendly that is when it's not your own home and you just maybe want to make some changes that can serve you for the time that you're there and um maybe uh, give you a better uh, kitchen experience i've been let me first say that my kitchen has not been so friendly before um where i live there is uh, the house that i live in it was not a, actually a rental home and some of the rooms the, the landlord just converted some of the rooms into maybe something that he can rent out and so we ended up having some irregular like an irregular plan and sometimes you may find that your maybe even your bathroom your bathroom to this one house is big the other one is small and they, there's no the proportions are not all that as when you're building like rental apartments where everything is uniform and so much more uh, in this in this house my kitchen doesn't have a the working space there's the working space in my kitchen is very limited and that is one thing that has really been boggling my mind and i decided to make something that will enable me work more comfortably inside the kitchen so so let me add to this and say that okay some maybe someone you're asking yourself why why bother like doing these makeovers when you can just maybe move to another house that has the facilities that you feel that you need uh, first of all, I'd say there are merits to living in this space. Uh, the space is quite convenient for us and we wouldn't want to move to another space. Like, we don't even have those plans in the near future. So, I just figured out that it's better to improve where I am right now because, after all, we are not moving and there is some privacy which I really value that you will not mostly find in a rental apartment and so that is something it's our own compound and there's there's, a, there's that privacy that you didn't find in a maybe in, a, in an apartment and i prefer that is 
that that alone is one big advantage that will would make us maybe prefer to stay here and improve uh, improve to and work with what we have for the time being so that is the reason why i did a mini makeover instead of maybe starting to search for for a house that has a, a kitchen with a working space come in different colors so I wanted a black surface I find black surfaces really elegant as long as they are maybe glossy and smooth and such so I chose the black one and these are two we ended up using two only uh, but the pack is made up of four you buy as a pack of four that is uh, at about 1800 so this square square ceramic tiles are the ones that we put as the our our top as you can see they make the top my actual working space so the other thing that we used is this they are called mdf boards and these ones also you can get them in your local hardware 
um, this, this one in color white uh, it's a smooth one so this is the one that we used to make uh, the whole fan and I really wanted to have a space where I could store my 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 gas cylinder I don't like the way when it's exposed as you'll see in the in the before video the gas cylinder was very much exposed actually there was nothing like it just looks dangerous and then I, I also wanted some extra space for storage because there are some where well, I used to store my things in the other the older cabinet the ones that were already already in the house but still they were not enough most of my stuff I had even moved them to a to a different room so now I will be able even if I purchase more and more utensils and superiors and, and such stuff I'll have a safe place especially glassware like such glassware if, if, if I need big bowls I really didn't have somewhere to store them for I just ended up not just having those stuff because I don't even have storage for them and it would be chaotic when you buy such stuff and you know yeah, place them. So the biggest the best thing about these is uh, the big working space now. I'm able to put my I'm able to um, prepare my ingredients here as I easily cook as you can see. It's now it was leveled it was leveled to fit the same height with my cooker so that I'll have a, a good and easy time while preparing my meals and I'm really loving it.